Hello everyone, we have here exponential equation to solve on the board. x to the power x to the power negative one half equals parenthesis one third raised to the power of square root of three. And we're looking for the value of x. And before we start, for those new to my channel, please don't forget to like and subscribe for more videos. I will appreciate it. Thank you. And now let's start solving the exponential equation. Just by looking at the equation, I think uh, some of you guys might know the answer already, but uh, in case you don't know, well, we start solving. So let's do it. So the equation x to the power x to the power negative one half equals parenthesis one third to the power is square root of three. Now we focus on the right side of the equation. One third raised to the power is square root of three. And this is square root of 3, it could be written the same way as 3 raised to 1 half power. And in here, the right side of the equation now becomes 1 third raised to the power 3 raised to the 1 half power. And uh, focus our attention on here again, on the exponent 3 raised to the 1 half power. And we're using an exponent rule, exponent formula. That is, a raised to m is equal to 1 over a raised to negative m. So we use that on the right side of the equation, exponent 3 to the 1 half power, I should say. So in here now, parenthesis 1 third raised to 1 over 3 raised to negative 1 half. And this exponent could be written the same way as parenthesis one third raised to one third raised to negative one half power. That is one third raised to negative one half power. Left side of the, of the equation the same way x to the power x to the power negative one half. And from here, if you notice, there's a direct comparison of the base when it comes to the exponent. So one third raised to the exponent one third. On the left side, x to so the exponent x, and this exponent is negative one half. And the same thing over here is negative one half. So what does it mean by that? That means the value, the value of x is equal to one third. So x is equal to one third. That's the final answer. From here, if we were to check our answer, so it's the value of x to the original equation. Here I have written the original equation and to check. Okay, we have the value of x that is one third. So we have now one third. The left side is one third raised to one third. That's x raised to negative one half. And the right side of the equation, we're using one third as value of x. And the right side is one third raised to the square root of three. And uh, square root of three is the same way written as three raised to one half. And if we get the reciprocal of that, this could be written the same way as one over. 3 raised to the negative 1 half power. So this one right here, if you notice, that is the same as this one right here. Left side of the equation. So in here then, that is now 1 third raised to 1 third negative 1 half is this one right here. Is the square root of 3. So this is equal to same way as the right side of the equation. All right. So that's all for now and uh, for those new to my channel, I would appreciate if you can subscribe to my channel and uh, so we can have more videos in the future. Alright, thank you very much and I will see you in the next videos. All well, you guys have a great day. Bye.